Hey, what's the deal, Collector Sagittarius? You might be coming off on Pony's Tarot channel like an energy vampire because you're probably fighting with your demons. Uh, you could be also sexually frustrated or just frustrated with people and needing to recharge your damn battery. You seeing that everything with these people are not bubbly in all oh, glass or people think this way about you, boo. And it's a lot more to you than that. And you're getting tired of people coming at you in that way. That's why I know that when you start your business, when you get on the right track, you're going to meet somebody out there that's doing the same thing you're doing. Because as you see, these low vibrational hosts are doing the same things that they do and try to come at you with that shit and it got dismissed. Yeah, this energy vampire that's trying to fill the void by fucking with you are making excuses for why they've been sitting on their asses. This king. Of ones haven't been reflecting shit or using their intuition if they've been dealing with a karmic, right? What ideas are you ready to imply with others? So this person is always talking shit, draining probably other people energy. This Leo, Aries, or this uh, probably person of the same sign as you, boo. Mm hmm. Probably the same sign as you. Aquarius. It's the opposite of this Leo. Aries is Libra. Sagittarius, we know it's Gemini. Could be dark signs as well. Got this Taurus out here, upside down with their fighting with their demons because they're in the unrequited ass love or the people they choose to listen to. <sighs> it's not changing anything or probably even influencing them. Hmm. You picking up another cup. You might be in regret when it comes to this cancer you met. Hmm. Yeah, you might be in regret about the cancer you met. What offers or opportunity is being presented to you that you may not be recognizing? So maybe you didn't give this cancer really time to play with you. Or that maybe they thought that they could play with you and then you just blocked them, boo. Whatever this water sign is. Maybe Sagittarius, you're not seeing that you might need some self-care and nurturing. Or maybe it's hard for you to get or get it from who you want it from or just properly get it. What situation in your life is required analyzing and researching this vampire energy needs to do some analyzing and researching while they applying shit to other people. Trying to come up with some ideas. Because this person that they dealing with is fighting with their demons. This baby mama or daddy or this mother-in-law or their own mother. What am I ready to commit to in my life? This person is fighting with their demons. So this could be your person fighting with their demons because they ready to commit to something. And it could be you, boo. And whoever they dealing with that's trying to fill some void with their bullshit. And they been talking their fucking mouths off and thinking about what they're going to say to other people to make themselves look good. So they've been doing analyzing and researching on something this page. Probably on you, boo. Because your person probably been watching you and you could be what they're fighting to come towards. Yeah. Maybe because of what you're saying or what they're hearing about you is making them want to change. Or you could have this cancer energy that's probably in a relationship fighting with their demon side that's seen your website or some people seen your website and they looking at you as the empress. 
and they're in this page of source energy. They analyzing you, these vampires, or wherever they can see you. What situation in your life requires slow movement and determination? That's where you're at. Ooh, we doggy, yes. And you probably protecting it. You probably putting that cup down, not picking it up. You probably regret that cup. That's why you picked it up and now you putting it back down. You fixed it type shit. With this cap cancer energy, a little crap. Probably working, going just home into work. Or just focusing on yourself with this Taurus energy. And, the, and this Virgo, Taurus standing with it. Virgo, having good judgment. Capricorn, taste, feel, smell. Walking it like you're talking. So this person trying to see what they're going to lie and apply to others after they do some research searching so they could reflect on with this six, some kind of love that might uh, be more adaptable with this Gemini, two-faced and confusing. I don't know what this fuck is up to, but they trying to reflect. Maybe they trying to reflect that they love themselves too with this six. Because your person has logical and clarity about you and what the fuck you stand for with this blue. Trying to keep calm, responsible, but a little sad or probably sensitive about what they're hearing. So this person could be fighting with their demons because they really hearing how you feel about them or seeing how you could just easily let go. Or seeing how you really needed them and the shit you needed them for didn't even cost money, honey. Or it wouldn't have been a lot to do. Just lazy as fuck. So now they got some kind of logical and clarity. It's probably about your motherfucking intuition. Positive changes you having in your life. With this 18 on this moon. Yes. This bitch is not going to balance anything if they come towards you. If you looked at my last video, whatever action they think they're going to play with. It ain't happening, Captain. What situation in your life is asking you to have patience and determination? So they've been doing some research to reflect this kind of love. Probably that they having a good sex life or they better in bed than you or whatever they hear. They feel like they have to compete with you about. It's all bullshit. They draining their own fucking energy. What skills are you being uh, called to create? So your person trying to create a skill. You over there protecting something. Maybe they trying to create a skill to get in this kind of energy. In the situation, where can you find wisdom and stability? Yeah. So you're with this 18. Mm-hmm. You trying to find wisdom and stability and protect it and move in it with this emperor energy. Proud community, what the fuck is up? This motherfucking vampire ain't even thinking. But they are thinking of something. Remember, they've been doing research and trying to manage what they have, I guess, to bring it out at the right time. What situation in your life do you need to look at from a different perspective? This this energy vampire and whatever they are going to go tell people and look stupid. They might want to look at this shit from a different perspective. Okay, so it seems like whatever this karmic is thinking to say about the collective Sagittarius and try to reflect with your person that you know or if this the karmic thinking this is you your person reflecting love right with that six on what they want so this person in this relationship with this Libra trying to balance things and confuse shit and gonna stay on top of it with this Aries energy Gonna be cold about it. 
Yeah, after they do their little research. And they, I feel like they're not going to find shit on this yin and yang. So if your person left home, this person is probably trying to come up with an excuse or research or get receipts on they bullshit. Like, say this person said some stupid shit about you before, and now they trying to get proof of it. Yeah, they trying to think about how they could trap your person. Your person trying to develop something and they thinking about how they going to trap them. Because your person want to commit to something. So your person is fighting with this karmic. Dealing with your demons before they deal with you is what that shadow means. Your person trying to get away from this karmic if you see my last video. Your karma trying to replace your person. If they can't replace your person, they gonna torture your person. Your person like Zoom. I'd rather get the fuck out of here. Yes, this, it will not be no agreement about this heart and intellect or whatever they're trying to communicate with this communication. What is being closed off or blocked out of your reality? Maybe this person is trying to trap your person. And it's getting blocked at your person. Like this person, this karma. See, they need to look at things at a, at, They need to look at things from a different perspective. So they don't see that your person is probably being creative, <laughs> trying to get unstuck, Th seeing things more logical about they dumb ass compared to you, boo. Compared to. Com a minute person and to commit a, a husband or wifey material compared to just some baby mama, baby daddy. They think they feel like they're important just because they had your person baby. When it takes two dumbass. Half and half. How else you got it? Unless you got both. And we're fucking yourself, and I didn't know it. No, I'm just playing. Let me stop going. How else, dummy? And so I hope the collective got that understanding that it's not about the baby. It's probably the responsibility of it or how it happened with some of y'all. But this comic is stupid. We talked about a baby or a, a kid situation that this comic was trying to act like they was passionate about and probably was going around making it seem like this is hurtful or how, you know, um, your person probably have been sitting around not being very creative because they was a different type of inspired person, right? Um, they got with Karmic because they was happy where Karmic was. You was up too high. Your vibration was too high. You know, they could have built the karmic or broke the karmic. That's why they went over there. They could piss shit and lay all day and smoke and put the cigarette ashes on the floor over there. You know? An important message or fast movement might be coming in for you. You might have an emperor that want to balance things with you. What situation in your life do you feel is secretly being hidden from you? Sagi, what do you feel is being hidden from you when it comes to these people? Hmm. What situation in your life requires slow move? So somebody to me is trying to come slow at you. Probably in this emperor energy because they want to take action because this is all you. Or she is trying to come slow at you, right? After she or he didn't make some positive changes with this Pisces energy, want to move in it, build a vibe, uh, type, uh, type of shit. They want to build a vibe. Pisces energy. See that Pisces energy build a vibe in that Sagittarius tool? Hello, boo. What y'all want to do? Huh? Step up or get laid? Get step, step up or get left. Not laid, left. And I think that's what this karma failed to do, right? 
and you did this to your person. That's why this is a domino effect. That's the biggest thing about relationships. It's a domino effect. And this karmic is not getting it. What I tell you? Shit's coming to an end. On um, this yin yin yang. On um, this yin yin yang. This Scorpio water energy. Been thinking about that yin yin yang. And they having a spiritual transformation, right? So they might come at you in this energy, but we'll see if this don't be someone else or two other people that you probably have met already that are in this energy, but probably married, you know. But no, I feel like this could be your ex-person coming at you. But let's keep an open mind for some of y'all that go out more than others. You will know. If you don't go out that much and you've been tending to the kids in your business, then you should know this might be your ex. If you know you go out, then you might have two people looking at you, or three, including your ex. So this Carmen needs to look at things from a different perspective, that your person is on sad and evil wickedness, devilish and everything else that is connected to them. Is that Satan? Evil wickedness? That's for 13. So maybe that's what your person, the Scorpio energy, is putting into this Leo energy, this relationship. That's what, not Leo, excuse me, Libra. That's what re Libra represents relationships. Which is the opposite of every somebody in war, in their relationship probably. This mama, baby mama in with this bull NG Scorpio, right? That bull NG with this Aries NG, probably they mama or somebody, or they baby mama or in law. That they have logic about. Compared to you, maybe baby mama, it doesn't matter, baby daddy, husband or wifey, ex, you know. What aspect of your life needs rest and healing? This karma needs to go rest their motherfucking nerves and stop thinking. Ooh, this karma got a lot of time on their hand. They just can't let go. What are you ready to recognize for all your effort? Yeah, your person is ready to put some effort. Or maybe they recognize what you put effort into. Or what this karma put effort into to destroy their funky asses. That's why they're going through a transformation. They thinking back just like you thinking back. Uh, how about your your person probably don't have no good quality or valuable times they could say they had with this karmic, just like they didn't that they just like excuse me they didn't they didn't they didn't even try to give you. As there are a lot of people that are nice to the wrong people purposely. They think that being a fool is cool. You was a square. You was all this other shit. But it was working for you. And there's all examples around if this is a dope boy, a deadbeat dad, a deadbeat mom, a scamming ass mom, a welfare fraud type chick. It doesn't matter. There's so many examples of what happened to these type of people. Like, people talk about me doing security, but I don't know too many security guards that don't live a steady fucking life, and I don't see why you can't learn why you're doing security. For an example, for some of y'all, or people that do take their time when they're bored and do something productive with it. So it's like, that's what you've been doing. That's why I slowly for surely it's going to build whether you trying or not. It's like you're manifesting. Yes, your person learned a valuable fucking lesson about how this comic went through all this shit to destroy their asses. Or that didn't have it together. Okay, not your person, sorry, but this comic. That's why they're going through anxiety and shit like this. 
because this Scorpio is going to be the reason why they have all this Taurus, going to be the reason why this relationship uh, Libra is going to come to an end and shit going to be unbalanced, friend. They're going to be falling. That's why they're not looking at things from a different perspective because evidently being lazy, crazy, and annoying works for them. It's a distraction. Your person uh, always probably having to uh, control tactics, always having to explain where they at, where they going, what they doing, or letting them cheat and do what they want while they out doing what the fuck they want to do. And your person thinking they running game when they really been lame. Yes, running game. So your person like what looking at what accomplishments have they gotten out of this? This came in reverse. So I guess if they want to be recognized for all their effort and accomplishments, right? It would be with you, boo, huh? And what is that, friend? A ten, six, four, ten, with the Empress. Out here sticking out with the Emperor. What the fuck is this? Not beautiful. Come on, man. Twin flame connection. Y'all both going through a transformation. That's why this person fighting with their demons. And you taking action. This person is right on that ass. Right on your ass. Riding on it. Busting out. The same bitch that thought they could send you requests, play with you, or whatever, boo. Yeah, they about to, regardless if this fucking water sign come towards you or not, they still going to get their karma because, you know, one of the commenters or subscribers or one of my people did say, um, right, uh, your person had this karma playing with you entangling you and everything and they gonna be the one to give it to them two birds of a feather flock together and like I said on my last video one is about to leave the nest what situation in your life is creating some type of power struggle yeah is this creating a power struggle because you probably feel like you need care and you probably feel like you need support with your swords on the ground and all you getting is fucking clowns in your face making you feel like you're in regret. This same bitch that want to play with you, they gonna be the one that get the karma from your person, boo. Is what I was trying to say earlier, a minute ago. Got caught off track thinking what time it was. But yes, this is what's going to happen with this karmic. Wherever they put in their household, their friends, and wherever they've been talking shit and gossiping, that shit about to come to an end, friend. Are you prepared to have a new beginning in love? So maybe this karmic is already dealing with someone that's in this sign. Or the opposite, Gemini, Libra, mm -hmm. Aquarius. Maybe that's what, why, uh, maybe karmic is draining your person energy because they already got someone that they could replace them with. Or someone that's in this energy about passion and love. Because how you going to be an energy vampire but still have passion, love, and anger, and stability and security with this brown. Using intuition. So I guess this karma keeps some, got someone already in position. That's why they're picking on your person. And your person fighting with their demon side, watching you. You're like making this person feel better, boo. The same thing this karmic you, this person did to you, this karmic is doing to them. Mm-hmm. Try to mix these cards up. I know which who's next, though. 
destroy y'all. Yes, yeah, your person want to return to faith and let go of this burden. What are you becoming overwhelmed in life with? What did we talk about in those other videos? Your person trying to pretend that these people, this situation is not draining them. Because it's been draining them. That's why they looked at you as their peace. It's been draining them. That's why they've been watching you and getting mad at you for feeling abandoned, boo. It's, it's draining them. That's why they had this revengeful ass, I'm going to punish you ass sex with you. Wanted you to submit in the wrong goddamn way. Want to keep you confused. You put up boundaries to this shit, this toxic ass relationship and these toxic ass people. You be damned if your person want to come towards you because they know you smarter and got it going on better. But choose back, choose to go back to this dumb ass. Fuck what they thinking. Like you was going to even risk your health knowing they dealing with a fucking karmic. They can risk their goddamn health. They can believe that bitch if they want to. Low vibrational hoes do the same shit, and your person still ain't learned. But I told you, now this person want to take it, invest their time and energy into someone else and get lucky with that seven, and they sticking with it with that bull. But that also could be that Taurus Scorpio energy that probably is tired of this vampire that's dealing with their demons, that's trying to change and act like they're a traditional but they really a burden. And need self-care. Because they feeling in regret. About this toxic ass relationship they're in. So your thing is you need to keep working. So that you don't ever get in regret. And protect where you're going and what deep in your heart so you keep shit moving you need to start recognizing and thinking about what you're not recognizing about this couple that needs self care cause they see you care about your fucking self yeah this vampire feeling like this with this five, like nothing gonna change this Scorpio Taurus energy. Mm-hmm. I say Taurus, Scorpio, they the opposites of each other. Then we're probably a fire sign. A fire signs with all them signs on there that are energy vampires. Probably they mom, they dad, they brothers, all in this energy, regardless if that's their signs or not. Yeah, even with this burden with this baby. Or babies, or what people gonna think about these kids and all this shit with this Leo energy at the top of Aquarius, probably the opposite with this tool. They've been keeping a burden, they've been committed to in their life, keeping it a secret, being shallow when they really probably cuckoo and need nurturing. What signs are preparing you to move into a different direction? Yeah, your person wants to move in a different direction. And he, uh, from this karmic, what painful situation in your life are you focused on and what positive aspects are you not seeing this karmic or this water energy? It's like, what part, what's, what are you waiting on, dumbass? Why are you just standing there? You've been standing there not doing nothing and thought you was getting lucky. But, baby, let me say this before the video stop. Whoever you're with is a reflection of you. If you look at your kids, you look at your partner, those are the people you love behind closed doors. Those people should be a reflection on how you're treating your goddamn self. And I hope you hit me up for a personal reading, and I hope you enjoy my videos.